Okay. Hey Audacious Church, um, my name's Avia. Um, I'm one of the college students at Audacious College this year and I'm a youth intern. Um, and this morning I just want to share a Bible story with you in Luke 10 and it's verse 38 to 41 and it's about Mary and Martha. And it says this, um, as Jesus and his disciples were on their way, he came to a village where a woman named Mary Martha opened her home to him. She had a sister called Mary who sat at the Lord's feet listening to what he said. But Martha was distracted by all the preparations that had to be made. She came to him and asked, Lord, don't you care that my sister's left me to do the work by myself? Tell her to help me. Martha, Martha, the Lord answered, you are worried and upset about many things, but few things are needed or indeed only one. Mary has chosen what is better and it will not be taken away from her. And I, lo I love this Bible story, it's one of my favourite. Um, and the reason is, is just imagining Jesus sitting and talking with Mary and also Mary's heart position of, I wanna sit at Jesus' feet. Um, and I just wanted to encourage you um, today and during this Easter period that we can be so busy and so easily distracted, like I know I can, um, you know, with Easter eggs, meeting family and all of the rest of it. Um, but the heart, but I just want to encourage you to remember the heart of Easter. And it's about, you know, Jesus's resurrection and how he died on the cross for our sins and because he loved us so much. Um, and that is what I want to share with you all today. And um, I'm just gonna pray over us. So uh, thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. Um, for today, Lord, I thank you uh, for what you're going to do. Lord, I thank you for Easter. I thank you for sending your son on the cross for us. Lord, and I pray over everyone this week, Father, that they will have hearts uh, just to sit and listen to you, Lord, that will make the space to just spend time in your presence over this busy period. And I thank you for who you are and for the love that you show us. In Jesus' name, amen.